and I was in the military in 1961, and I got hurt at Fort uh, Gordon, Kentucky, in uh, Georgia. Excuse me, Fort Benning, Georgia, in Kentucky. Uh, I won't get it right in Mississippi. And it, anyway, um, I was uh, hurt real bad. And for about 30 some odd years, I went to the chiropractor on a regular basis, sometimes three times a week. And after those many years, he said to me, he said, there's nothing else that I can do. And he did send me to a doctor that gave me some injections, uh, two sets of injections. And the second set lasted for about 15 years. And then I started having problems again and never could find anyone that could really help me. And so um, three years ago, roughly, I had 865 days of, I'd say anywhere from five to 10 pain level. And this past year of uh, 23, I had back surgery on my second, third, fourth, fifth lumbar. And uh, it helped a, a lot, but then I uh, developed another issue in June of, of last year on Father's Day, and I basically hit the floor and I ended up uh, going to the emergency room. And then I finally got to see my back doctor about two weeks later and come to find out I had two pinched nerves below my surgery. As a result of that, uh, they put me on medication that pretty much uh, put me bedridden because uh, of the pain I had. And I, I couldn't go to the bathroom, couldn't pee or whatever. And I was just gaining weight and blowed up like a balloon. And I had so much pain in my legs. It's just unbearable. And uh, I had like Charlie horses, uh, like an athlete would, would do. And just to the point that I couldn't rest at all. And I went 42 days without being able to sleep in my bed. It was wow. really, really, really <laughs> difficult. And uh I couldn't even lounge back in a chair. I had to sit up straight. And most I slept at any, any time in those 42 days for consecutive minutes or hours was four hours. And most time it was one to two. And so, uh, you know, I just kept praying for the good Lord to send something to to bless me. And I, I'll say right here now, zero doubt in my mind, this is God sent. And so as time passed on, uh, I went to my uh, dermatologist in December because uh, that was my regular checkup time. I'd had psoriasis from the time I was 12 till I was 74, which was 62 years. And when I got there, you know, we were talking about pain and so forth. And uh, and I was telling how bad my hips and my uh, legs were killing me all the time. And she said... Uh, you know, uh, let's let's do a exam and whatever. And she said you have a uh, psoriatic arthritis. So I had bone spurs, regular arthritis, or and then I had the pinched nerves, and then I get the psoriatic arthritis on top of that. So you can imagine. Uh, I always say my pain level was ten plus because it was the point that you know I didn't think I was going to make it, and so. Uh, it's really strange how life happens. Sometimes it's very difficult time, and then sometimes it's very simple. So what happened was uh, I got to the point that, you know, I just wanted something to happen. I got on a Zoom call with another business, and sometimes when I'm on a Zoom call, I look at uh, on Facebook at people they talk about to see if they might be friends or some of my friends, and all of a sudden, Eric Bill's name popped up, and I said, my goodness, I haven't talked to him in 25 years. I wonder where he is. Well, I didn't have a phone number for him, so doing what I do, I put, I went to Messenger on Facebook and uh, sent him a message to send me, I mean, to call me on my phone number, and I sent it to him, and he did, and we began just talking in general, and all of a sudden, he, he started talking about health. And I said, man, you wouldn't believe the back pain I got. So he told me about the patches, and I said, I need them ASAP. So we ordered them on the second day of April. I got them on the 5th. My regiment normally would be, before I go to bed, I'd take a uh, pain pill for my arthritis. I would take a sleeping pill 
I would take a science peel for my breathing and I would take a tablespoon and a half of mustard because that's what kind of relieved the Charlie horses and the cramps in my leg. And so I also was using another type patch. I'll just say that up front. It was very good for me when I had my back surgery uh, because I never took a pain pill after back surgery. I just used the patch. And so anyway, uh, I told Linda that night, I said, I'm going, that's Linda's my wife. I said, uh, I'm not going to do any of my regular regimen. I'm going to see if this really, really works. Well, folks, I went to bed that night, not knowing what to expect. I slept till 7.30 the next morning. And then all of a sudden I, I went laying there and I, I said, my goodness, I can breathe. So I'd already had two sinus surgeries and a nose surgery and I still had trouble breathing. And uh, all of a sudden I'm breathing and I'm thinking, well, you goofy guy, you had all this pain. How come you didn't think about pain first? But what I didn't realize was I didn't have any pain either. So uh, they call me the one one patch wonder. Uh, wow. so that's, that's just the way it happened. Well, as of tomorrow will be my sixth week. And I'm sitting here talking to all of you with no pain. <laughs> wow. That's God. Amazing. That's amazing. You were you were truly a one patch wonder. So you woke up the next morning, you put the Eon patch on at night, right? Yes. And you woke up and, and were you were pain free. Yes, I, I used the ice wave. Yeah. Ice wave, yeah. And and several others. I think I used four different patches the first night and you told me to wait on the X forty nine. And I did. Wow, I remember the phone call. It was astonishing. And you were so surprised you could breathe after all those years. Yep, I'm still breathing. <laughs> <laughs> and, and better that I still have some problems with, you know, sometimes it stops up, especially on my right side, which I had surgery on. But, uh, you know, overall, it's a blessing. It's God's sense. That's all I can say. Wow, that's incredible. I remember you reached out on Facebook just about some another issue, and it's just it's just miraculous. It's so awesome. And you're helping a lot of people. You're sharing the information, right? Yes, I am. And, you know, too, another thing that happened is you can see I'm, sitting here without glasses on and I used to have to look all the time uh you know I'd be wearing glasses or when I'm looking at uh, Facebook or I'm on a computer I don't wear glasses just on a regular basis but uh I don't have to wear glasses now to see the computer that's what I'm saying Wow, I, I remember that. Was that about a week or week and a half in? I saw all of a sudden he said, Do you notice I'm not wearing my glasses looking at the computer? It's probably about 10 days, I'd say. Yeah. 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 You're a double, you're a triple one patch wonder. I am. Wow. Wow. I'm blessed. That's so I, I have a question. So Kenny, how do you mind me asking how old you are? 81. Oh my, oh my gosh. 